What's up guys, it's Thorman back here with another video. Today we're going to be recording another video. Uh, as you guys can see, uh, we're going to be doing the iPhone 8 Plus unboxing. I wanted to make this video a little more professional than I usually do. Uh, so yes, this is once again the iPhone 8 Plus unboxing. I put it back in the box, but I've used this for about three days. haven't really used it because I've been serving uh, for something called Shepherd's Conference for my church. Alright guys, well here it is, the iPhone 8 Plus. This is such a great phone. I did choose the uh, the, the silverish color and I really do like it. So um, I did trade my 6S Plus in for $140. So I got this phone for a very good price, $140. I got the case for $40. This is uh, OtterBox, uh, one of the best cases. I've got a clear one so you can see the color. Shout out to my guy Vince. Uh, Ambers, whatever, Vince. I've been working with this guy for about a week, um, over now, but uh, he's been helping me get this phone. So here we go, a uh, very sleek look. This is the 64 gigabyte one. Whoops, I put this on backwards. This is the 64 gigabyte one, very clear, um, clean. It doesn't say iPhone 8 and all this extra information, it just shows the picture of the phone. So let's get into it right now. As soon as you open up, open it up, you see uh, usually the instruction manual, but I don't have that. This is the phone, the beautiful iPhone 8 Plus. Um, look at this. It's nice. It looks very sleek, very big, very, very good camera. I do have a picture on Instagram that I did post a couple with portrait mode. And portrait mode is my new favorite thing when it comes to this. So the first thing that comes up, uh, very messy I put in here, is the jack for the normal earphones, 3.5 millimeter, millimeter earphones for the headphone jack. Um, because as you guys can see, this doesn't have any uh, headphone jack, so you have to plug this in here to use the earphones. But it does come with these earphones that are meant for it. These are meant for, you know, the iPhone 7 and up. Um, they, I think they did this just so it can become a little more uh, water resistant. And yes, it is water resistant. I think that I think that is on the box saying that you know it is water, not waterproof. But uh, people have done some tests and it does look waterproof. So yes, as you guys can see with these earphones, these do have the same jack as you plug your phone in. It's kind of sucks. You have to do buy something separate to do that uh, to plug your phone in. And the last thing that comes into the box, the last two things is of course the one and only charger. So without further ado, let's get into the review with the iPhone 8 Plus. So yes, this is my favorite phone. It's great because it doesn't have a real home button to click on. It just has the 3D home button. So when you click on it, you do hear it, but that's it's kind of like, you know, when you turn your ringer off, you hear that, um, that sound. So yeah, that's one great feature about this phone. Another great feature is that it has a 4.0 stereo. What I mean by 4.0 means that besides the speakers coming out through here, there's vibration throughout the whole phone when you play music. So that means if I were to play a song, it doesn't just come out of these, it comes out of the top as well. This, this speaker, is, it's a speaker and a microphone, I think, because you do hear the sound from there. Very loud, look how loud it goes. That's a very, very loud phone, which is, uh, you know, good if you're like listening to music with your friends. I know that the display is way more HD than the, than the usual, the normal iPhone 6. Uh, I forgot, I forgot what kind of display it is, but, uh, here, let's turn this down. But I know that it is way better. Um, I feel like it's, a little, even though it's, all responsive. I feel like this is just, I don't know, this feels a little different. It feels way faster. So yeah, so now I'm going to show you what portrait mode is. Let me show you a picture that I did take with my, with my, with my phone. Um, it is very HD. Like for example, I took a couple of these at Shepherd's Conference. Let me go to Instagram and show you. So here's one of them. So here are just a couple of the pictures that I took. Uh, I don't know if you can see them, but my Instagram is Donman Firefighter Explorer. These are very HD, like a DSLR. Um, like, it's amazing how HD this phone is with portrait mode. So yes, those are just a couple of the great, amazing feature that this phone does have. 
It has something called True Tone. I do not like it. Many people like it. It's when you turn this on, the tone looks a little different. Whoa. Yeah. The screen looks a little more yellow, you know? Uh, I know you can't really tell, but when I turn it off, it looks bright, but when I turn it back on, it just gets a little darker. I mean, it gets a little yellowish. I don't know why people would like this. It, to me, it's just a waste. But And besides that, another great feature about this phone is the whole, it's all glass. Uh, usually, you know, we would have like, the plasticky thing. This is all glass, it's all very shiny. But I do have the OtterBox case, which um, which is good. Um, so you can see the shininess, you can see the color of the phone. Um, so when I put it on, of course it feels different. I, I like the glassy feeling. It has tons of grip. Let me just snap this in. There you go. Snap the case in. You can still see it perfectly fine. Doesn't look as clean, but uh, you know, it's better than sorry. So yes, I'm doing research on this phone and it does look like it's IP7, whatever that means. IP7 splash resistant and uh, splash, splash proof and dust proof. So I guess that's very good. Like for example, my um, my home button, like I already, I'm already having, can't even open my messages. There you go. So like for example, one time my home button was sticky and then uh, cause I had, you know, food on my thumb or something and I was like, oh no, it's sticky. But I, I remember that it's not like the home button. So for example, my other home button was sticky, so it made a loud clicking sound, but no matter how much thing you put on the home button, it will never get sticky. It is the same 12 megapixel camera, but um, it does have dual cameras, as you guys can see. It does have dual cameras. Uh, and I know the flash is different. It's, um, it's, a, it's, a more, it's a more white flash. I know all flashes are white, but look, it's, it's not as yellow even though, you know, it's not yellow at all, but uh, it's just like even brighter. Uh, sorry, that's the brightest. <laughs> uh, so yeah, pretty bright flash. Um, so besides that, thank you so much for watching this iPhone 8 review. Uh, please like, subscribe, and tell your friends about this channel. Uh, if you guys want uh, another review on anything else, just, just go to the comments. This is a great, great phone. I do recommend this. Uh, besides the expensive price, I wouldn't pay 800 for this. Um, but for 140, wow, it's great. It's great. It's a great phone. It's a great upgrade. See you guys in the next video.